Nearly 18 years after Amber Wilde disappeared, police now say she was murdered and they think they know who did it. It is a major development in a case the victim's family says had hit a wall. Our Casey Geraldo spoke with the Wilde family this evening. Casey. Wilde's aunt got the call today. She tells me she was surprised to hear there was new information in the case, but not surprised by what it was. Amber Wilde was murdered. It's the newest information from police confirming her family's suspicions since Wildey's 1998 disappearance. We wait for answers and, you know, nothing comes of it, then you know, we wait again. But Green Bay police hope it won't be another 18 years of waiting to solve this case that they're now calling murder instead of a missing person. New information has police wanting to talk to Amber Wildey's former boyfriend. Police say they've always believed her disappearance was suspicious since Wilde was pregnant when she disappeared. Until this day, a day with an unexpected phone call, her family has waited. If we do find out where she is, if we can bring her home, I, I think that's all that we want. Wilde's family and police, still searching for answers, hope this new development will bring new information and bring her family some closure. So we want to be able to put her to rest and, you know, be able to say our goodbyes. Today's TMJ4 is not releasing the name of Wildy's former boyfriend since he has not been arrested or charged in connection with her murder.